That's what is amazing, that the, the trees, you plant a seed, it germinates, and it looks so fragile. And within a very short time, it becomes a huge tree. It gives you shade. It, if it is a fruit tree, it gives you fruit. If it is um, timber, it gives you timber. You are able to build your houses. I mean, it just transformed the life of the very women who planted the trees. It, in your book, and I, and I love your book, The Greenbelt Movement, um, but it, one of the things that I liked the most was a simple statement when you said the trees were a great symbol of hope. Yes, and, um, yes. And they are very empowering because, as I say, they start uh, as very vulnerable little tree seedlings, and then they grow into these huge uh, trees which pro improve your livelihood in your own lifetime. That's, that's really wonderful. And even your children, they see these trees grow, and even as they mature, suddenly they too turn to these trees to provide them themselves with the timber, maybe to build their houses. Sure. To They see these trees giving them fodder for the animals. So it is really something wonderful. And the tree becomes an ambassador for the others, so that as, as people see what's happening, they too come and join the campaign okay. because they see the results. But we want to see many Africans really demonstrating their commitment to their region by planting trees and stopping the process of processes of desertification, which are very strong in Africa. And this is something that um, for many Africans, really, there is absolutely no excuse not to stop desertification because this is something that is doable, it is cheap, um, and if you, if you follow the, the approach that the Green Belt Movement has been doing, you actually also put money on, in the hands or in the pockets of poor women. Because for every seedling that these women grow and they plant, if it survives, they get paid. Very small amount of money, it amounts to about four US cents per tree that That's is true. planted and survives. Very little money. But if, it, if the women are planting trees in their thousands, in their millions, that money is able to buy them food sometimes. Sometimes they're able to buy clothes. They're able to, to pay school fees. 